409. Christmas, just weeks away. And for some kids in Oklahoma, there will be no presents under the tree. One organization is trying to change that. News 9's Lacey Lowry tells us they're not only giving kids a Christmas they've never had, but a future they've only hoped for. What I enjoy most about it is knowing that somebody still cares. Youth Services for Oklahoma County hosted its annual Christmas party for homeless teens. Some of the kids' uh, families themselves are homeless. Some of them are incarcerated. Some of their families are deceased. It's all part of their skill program, or supporting kids in independent living. It's just so heartbreaking, and at the same time, just heartwarming, just because we're able to do something like this for them. Like Gabriel and Paula, both teenagers are on their own. They tell us they bounce around from couch to couch, but both have big dreams. Where I was living and how I was going about my life I probably wouldn't even um probably wouldn't be here right now Paula wants to join the National Guard and become a registered nurse her favorite present a book to help her study not even my own family have done anything for me like this none of them and for people <laughs> for people to that I don't even know to help me it's like the best thing in the world. Gabriel has worked as a handyman since he was just 12 years old. And for the very first time, he now has his own set of tools. But even with the great presents, which both teenagers say are more necessity than want, they get something even more out of the skill program. It feels amazing for, for someone to walk up to me and hug me. And th they don't even know me, but they care about me. It's the best feeling in the world is to know someone somebody still cares. Lacey Lowry, News 9. The YSOC is always needing donations. We hope you can help. Just log on to News9.com and look for this story.